so it's uh, your favorite uh, Chicago land area, Argentine, Irish, Syrian, uh, who has a passion for uh, works in between the Hasmonean and the fall of the Roman Empire. This includes uh, all the mystery religions, um, Zoroastrianism, Rahmanism, uh, various sorts of Gnosticism, all different forms of Christianity <clears throat> that no longer exist anymore. Um, I'm going to set up a Patreon account um, so that I can actually, uh, well, uh, so that I can uh, make better videos because um, there are these, there's a certain type of um, breed of cat out there on YouTube. These uh, people are known as douchebags. Um, I came across one who uh, makes videos on the occult and yet knows jack shit about the occult. He actually makes a lot of videos about Gnosticism and almost every single word that he says about Gnosticism incorrect. Boy, do I miss the days of James Epkendir's box of Life, Liberty, Love. Because they actually were concerned about, you know, they were interested in Gnosticism. They uh, were trying to seek gnosis, their knowledge. They were trying to seek truth. Um, Instead of just spouting out a bunch of nonsense that um, <sighs> hopefully other people thought they were smart when they spouted out this nonsense, but they didn't do this. Um, so I'm going to set up a Patreon. Um, don't worry, it's not going, uh, it, it's only going to go towards technology and, um, taking down these idiots. And I am, will invite, uh, those who have donated money in the past and, um, anyone who donates money in the future. And I will, uh, also take requests. Um, the Patreon will probably not. Uh, be up. It'll probably be up in a week or so. But um, yeah. Uh, stick, sex, and hammer. Wow. Stick, sex, and hammer. Six, six, six. I mean, what can I say? Every single thing, almost every single thing that he says is incorrect when it comes to Gnosticism, early Christianity, the Christians persecuted the Gnostics, you mean over a thousand years after Christianity became legal. And they weren't persecuting them because they were Gnostics. It was a land grab from princes of northern France trying to grab land in the longer dock region of southern France.
I mean, you would think that, you know, hey, uh, if you had been interested, if you have an interest in, um, you know, Gnosticism, you might read a book like this, even though it's a kind of shitty translation. Um, you might even read, you know, this, you know, Cornerstone of Western Civilization. <clears throat> <clears throat> but apparently not. So, um, yeah, and I'll also be taking a request. I did a um, an audio um, on nationalism. Um, but uh, I'm having trouble computer illiteracy of... Um, Syncing that up with uh, with images, um, promised Eric I would do that, um, but uh, that should be up shortly. So, um, thank you very much. I will. Uh, <clears throat> Hopefully the Patreon will be up within uh, a week, maybe two weeks, um, and hopefully this will help me get back uh, get me out of my funk from uh, that uh, or gut punch that I received from uh, the uh, the one who shall remain nameless. Peace to you, may get so Serbia, Syria, and Ireland. <laughs>